For the Marianists and many other consecrated religious, a key component of the consecrated life is living in community. If you're trying to live this life, you need supports and you need challenges. And community life does that for us. So I'm supported in the work that I do by the brothers that I live with. I'm also challenged, you know, to do better than I'm doing on different aspects of the life. And so I find for me, this, this is a trend of support in, in living, you know, the vocation that I have as a Marianist. I would say it keeps us rooted. Uh, there's a call to accountability in community. Uh, it helps me regain focus when I'm drifting. Um, it calls me to a deeper level of prayer. The community is there as a place for our, our meals, our sharing, our joys and our pains, um, the prayer together, which brings me great delight. Being with them in prayer and being with them at, at meals, it's, we get to share a lot of uh, who we are and what we're about and where we are with our struggles and our joys of faith. It is also a place of inspiration. The inspiration that comes from uh, uh, people who do different, different jobs, uh, have different interests, different ideas. Uh, so it is a melting pot uh, in uh, the best sense of that, uh, that word. It's just a whole set of relationships which I find very nourishing. And uh, so I'm very thankful for the gift of community. Nourished in community, the consecrated religious bring their charism to their ministries, building communities that challenge and support others to live their faith. I think what unites all the brothers together into one is our sense of mission and carrying out Mary's mission of uh, bringing Christ to the world. And here at the university, our focus is to really uh, look at where we're living in the student neighborhood and to say we're here because we want to be a part of the young people, men and women who are living here and to uh, invite them in, our sense of hospitality, but also then to go a little bit deeper into uh, the mission that we have here and why uh, the sense of community is important because it's the basis of small groups working together. We want to help people build communities that will support their growth in faith. You can witness as a community of people bringing your, your strengths, your gifts, your wisdom uh, together and, and the power of your prayer and community can transform the world. Well, our Marianist life started from like community, so that is the initial story, you know, that the vision that Father Shamanad had to come together and be that one family of Mary. So I think for each of us as Marianists, we find a way to bring the skills of community building into our teaching and into the, the work we do in our communities. It's all about supporting one another um, and positively challenging and affirming one another that we are all growing all the time. I think it's very exciting you know, to, to live that gift. I think it's that opening to allowing Mary to form us in the way that she helped Jesus discover his gifts. Uh, how do we as Marianists try to help others discover who their gifts are to be to the world? It's often great to go to alumni functions and just listen to people's stories and you can see that the University of Dayton has had a major impact on uh, their ability to not only be professionals in their field but be per people that are making a difference with their lives.